Any idea how I can get to Hiromi? Pulled the blueprint, got it all figured out. Okay, not all, but we're good on the penthouse. Best bets to access it from the service level. Got a way in from there. All right, we going in? Let's do this. Head in right after us. Go straight to clouds. About fucking time. Stay sharp. Gangoons might be lurking. Got a jack into the panel on the other side. Can you take him out? Why does everything here always have to go to shit? What then? Everyone all in position? Tom and Roxy should already be at Clouds. We go on Maiko's signal. They'll mop up security, you deal with Hiromi. But first, you gotta get into the penthouse. Okay, on my way. Elevator's on the other side. Be safe. Which floor? I'll take the lower level. Tom will head upstairs. We're all set. my mark. Go! I told you, have shit tons of work. No, don't. less trouble getting here. Luckily, they're all jacked into virtues. It'd be game over otherwise. Right, wrong. Chicks will give you shit no matter what you do. This one's a real charmer, too. I don't like her either. She tries too hard. Can we get this over with? Why are there three guys? What's she playing at? That's our target, Hiromi Sato. Who are the other two? Target audience of today's presentation. Hiromi answers to them directly. Now they're gonna watch him die in a pool of his own piss. 
This is not what we agreed. Look at me. See this? This is a look of unfucking surprise on my face. I know face. the clause. To them, power is a question of strength, ruthlessness. This is the only way. Maiko. I'm about to jack him out. They will not be chirpy after the rude awakening. One show ends, another begins. Just as good and unforgettable. Understand? All right, I'll do what I can. Jack him out. Well, she is no Barker. Wait. What's going on? Who is this? Living proof that Hiromisado's time is up. This merc has already disturbed the clientele at Clouds once. He murdered Oswald Forrest. And now he's invaded Mr. Sado's private residence. As if that were not enough, this is where Hiromi's sheer incompetence has led all of us to. What? What the hell? I have long looked upon Hiromi Sado's foolish, inept endeavors. But this? I think it's obvious he has outlived his usefulness. V, what the fuck's she doing? Cloud needs new management. Hold on, Michael. I think you're getting carried away. I see not all has been agreed. Dolls of Clouds are declaring their independence. Club will be run by them, and only them. V, let me do the talking. Tiger Claws will get a cut of the revenue, but they'll have no say in how the club is run. Stop this right now! I'll get everything under control. You cannot even control your own mercenary. Hiromi will answer for his incompetence later. Whereas you will answer for your insolence now. You dishonorable dog! Don't you dare touch me! Dean, what the hell were you thinking? Have you any idea what's gonna happen now? What might that be? They'll have their revenge. You've turned Clouds into a ticking time bomb. We can't know that for sure. Maybe the lives we cut short will be enough for the Claws. They do profit and loss better than Militech CEO. They'll see it's not worth it. They wipe their hands of the mocks. Maybe Clouds is due its freedom now. Time to let it go, Maiko. Get out! Get out now! All right, V, get out of there. Exit's on the lower level of the apartment. Then find the elevator. Tom and Roxy are outside and safe. They weren't followed. Get down to street level, waiting by the food stalls. Oh, fuck. Should have seen that coming. Probably had this planned from the start. Same sec we walked into her office. Jesus, am I a gunk. Who cares that she was scheming? We did it. That's what matters. Clouds belongs to the dolls now. You're right. That was the plan all along. And you made it happen. Thank you. See you later, V. See you around, Judy. <laughs>